Hey guys, this is Good Money Stewart coming back at you with part two of my haul on this Monday. What's today? Today is, I do believe, the 11th. 11, 12, 13, 14, 15. Yes, because Olivia's birthday is this coming Saturday. Happy birthday, Libby. She will be five. Count them, five. <laughs> I was so fortunate when Libby was born that I was in the birthing room when she was born. I got to cut the cord and everything. And then, do you know what happened? Do you know what happened? This is why I believe in the power of prayer. I don't care what nobody say. Because I'm sure going to say it on my channel. When she was born and they delivered her, she wasn't breathing. She was just an ash gray. And my daughter was like, Mom. And you know, they told us, get out the room. They didn't want us in the room. They they. It was me and her best friend there. And uh, so they said, you have to leave the room immediately. And I knew something was wrong. And so um, I just began to call people and tell them to pray. So I'm out there in that hallway and I'm praying and I'm speaking to the Lord. And I'm telling him, Lord, this is not going to happen. It's not going to happen. You say that I can ask anything in your name. And that if I ask in your name and believing that it can be done... And it just seems like it went for the longest, but they said it might have been about two or three minutes. And all of a sudden, I heard this cry, and it was loud, and it's been loud ever since, non-stoppable. And I tell Libby that story all the time, and she says, Granny, for real? And I say, for real. So sometimes she talks so much, I'm like, Libby, could you just be quiet for 10 seconds? And she says, okay, is 10 seconds up? So, so we're going to celebrate her week, uh, birthday weekend this week. So we're going to get started here. And as always, this is Good Money Stewart coming at you with a haul from the Dollar Tree in my neighborhood. Guys, these are so good. I think I did a review on these and I saw that they had some more. And they are Breakfast Biscuits Mixed Berry. They're by Columbia, Columbiana. Columbia. No. Columba. Columba Needs. Columba I believe that's how that says. These are really, really good. At first, when I saw what was on here, I thought, and I said, I am not going to like this. I thought it was uh, gluten-free or something like that, but it wasn't. So if you see these, grab these because they're really, really good. I got me my Mott's apple juice. Love it, love it, love it. It is a... What size bottle is this? A 32 ounce bottle. Me and Juliana really love this. It's 100% apple juice. I love it. Love it. Try to have one every morning with my two eggs and the apple juice. I love this Minute made rice. I love, I, I could eat this by itself really. Just put my onions and garlic or whatever in it. But what I've been doing is, I, and I'll have to show you that one day when I cook it. I cook this, then I get a can of pinto beans. It doesn't matter, any kind of beans. My onions, bell pepper, garlic, chop that up, put it in there. And then a can of diced tomatoes that have the garlic or whatever. Yes, I love garlic. And it's a good, really, a meal in itself, but I do it as a side dish. Then I got, I cannot find, I don't know why. I can, um, this is Martin Martinelli's uh, Sparkling White Grape. Uh, and this is so good, guys. Now, the bigger bottles are like, what, two, three dollars? But they used to do the grape one. I cannot find the grape one anymore. Uh, this is an eight ounce bottle. And since, you know, I'm not a drinker and this is non-alcoholic, I still love it. It tastes really good. I'm a person who likes to mix stuff up. I take orange juice, mix this with orange juice, or uh, I have a cranberry uh, lime, lemon lime that I have now. I'll mix that with that. And they are, the drinks, are, they come out good. Everybody loves them when I mix them like that. And my uh, Lifesavers, mint, wintergreen. Love these, love these. My mom used to love peppermints. Oh my God, my mom could go through a bag of peppermints like nobody's business. She called me up. Like, <laughs> that a winner. Uh, she called me fat gal. That's what my mom used to call me. Used to make me mad. I was like, Mom, don't call me that. 
and then she'll forget, hey, fat gal. But now you know what? If I could hear her call me fat gal, i let her call me fat gal all she wanted to. I sure would. Okay. And then, of course, y'all know these things with the karma. Y'all know. I love these things. I love them. Okay, and then I got this tub because someone dear to my heart, their birthday is coming up. And so I'm going to make them another, I'm going to do another one of my gift baskets. I'm going to have to start selling these things because when I do them, I fix them up really good, guys. I try to put stuff in there that they would like. And so, you know, I might just start doing that, you know. My sister-in-law does that and she, hi, Diane, and she does a wonderful job. She stays in um, Hawthorne. Hawthorne, California. I went to visit them this summer for two weeks. They put up with me for two weeks, guys. Yes, they did. And I had a wonderful, wonderful time. Okay, let's finish this up. These are items I did not see in the store before. But I happened to go today and they were there. These are by... Uh, girl, who is this? Hampton Art... And they are decorative tape. And look at this. Look at the product on here, you guys. You tell me that's not good product. A dollar for two. Not one, two. And I'm like, I, I got to get this. This is the first time I've seen these. Yeah, no, it's Hampton Art. And this is out of Washington, North Carolina. Yeah. A lot of product, guys. So that's that one. And then they show you the actual what they actually look like. Same company. And on this one it says uh open me and it's just and the other one says just for you. And there's two rows and they're 45 45 feet each. Look at that. I I was like I sh really should have bought more of these than what I did. But I think two, two rolls for a dollar? Come on. Instead of buying them little incy bency rolls, they be trying to get you to buy. I ain't buying that mess. Not for a dollar. I can use that on one envelope. I want product. I'm, I'm just cheap. No, <laughs> I believe it's saving a buck. Okay, this says happy birthday on both of these. And I thought, oh my gosh, I need to go back down to that store. I am. I'm going to have to go back in there and buy some more of these. I'm sorry. I am. <laughs> I'm going to go back and buy some more. So I got me two, four, six, six rows of this decorative tape for a dollar. Now, if, if someone's hauled these before and I missed it, then I apologize, but I've never seen these before. And then found some good stuff today, guys, in my neighborhood store, which they won't let me film in the store. But enough of that. Okay, I found these really nice cosmetic bag. Well, it says a clutch with a strap. And they're the uh, plastic, you know, the vinyl, the cheap pleather. But it's a cute pleather. Okay, you better open because if not, I'm taking you back. There's a little, oh, there we go. And then this is what it looks like inside. You can never have enough of these. They make lovely gifts. Look at this pretty color. Isn't that pretty? It looks kind of bluish, but it's not. Oh, I just love that. And then this one, I really, and I think I have a little coin purse that matches this. You know, after Christmas, I'm going to start my giveaways. I am. I'm not going to do it until after Christmas. Um, that's when I'm going to start mine back up. And I'm going to try to do one once a month. That's it. That's my limit. But I'm going to, and, and since it's going to be one once a month, I'm going to make it worth your while. So just keep your eyes and ears out because that's when I'm going to start doing mine. And then the last of these, it's Hello Beautiful. And these are more like a canvas. First time I've seen these in the store. Uh, cosmetic bag. They're really nice. This is what it looks like inside. Because usually you see Hello Gorgeous, but this one says Hello Beautiful, and I got two of those, so 
And they didn't have very many of those. But uh, that is my haul for today. And, you know, guys, I'm just glad to be at home. You know what? I am really literally a homebody. I really don't like being out unless I really have to be out. And my sister gets so mad at me. She's like, you're always up in the house. What are you doing up in the house? She is always on the go. Always on the go. But she's been like that since she was little. And she loves doing that. My sister... Excuse me, guys. I'm sorry. That was something that went off in my kitchen. And I don't know what that was. Kind of rattled me there. Because, let me tell you about this. I come home. My front door is not closed. Juliana went out this morning and uh, didn't secure the door. The second time she's done that. That's why every time I leave my house, before I go to work, I, Juliana, and Sayla, our little Pomeranian, I pray. I pray the covering and protection all over her as she walks to school, as I drive in my car, uh, when we're not at the house. I'm just a firm believer that the power of prayer will protect you during the day. And so I walked in and I thought, oh, no, but everything was in its place. Nothing was gone. And, and, and honestly, my neighborhood, you know, people say, oh, you live north. Yeah, I do. I live north, born and raised in North Omaha. The neighborhood I live in, I have really good neighbors. I really do. I mean, what can I say? They're good neighbors. It's a mixed neighborhood. Uh, um, everybody is so respectful of everybody. So I'm blessed in that aspect. I'm blessed. And so I just thank God for that. I had, y'all, I could tell y'all some stuff. I could tell y'all some stuff about my life. I'm thinking about doing a channel just different than this. And it's just something in the works. And I'm just um, asking God to show me how to do it. Because I really believe Miss Black Gold has encouraged me in a lot of ways. That there are things in me that... I just need to share, just need to share to bless somebody that maybe is going through that now that I've already been through. And yes, I've been through a lot, but you know what? I'm still standing. And the reason I'm still standing is because I trust the Lord with all my heart, because I know he has been a way maker, a provider, a healer, you know, oh, you got, oh, y'all, I got some stuff, I got some stuff to tell y'all, but I'm looking at my time too. So this is Good Money Steward coming at you. Omaha, Nebraska It's a good place to live if you really like a low, slow town. Okay, what is this? Thumbs up if you like my channel. Thumbs down if you don't like my channel. But by all means, please hit that subscription button down there below. And every time I upload a new video, you'll get to see it. And again, you guys, thank you so much for helping me to get to 100 subscribers oh my heart is still you know at church sunday i told them what happened and they were so happy they were like oh my god you know they just encouraged me and so to my home church spirit truth and gospel church here in omaha nebraska pastor tyrone and jerry charleston hey there love you guys um and a shout out to jory we know your birthday coming up girl you gonna be 26 yes i'm just Lift it. And you know what? And I'm giving a shout out to all my new subscribers. Thank you from the bottom of my heart. You guys rocked for me. I mean, y'all came over. Miss Gold said something and y'all came over. So you know what? Miss Deb is so happy to have y'all here. And I hope you enjoy my home. I hope I treat you well. And if it don't, let me know. But this is Good Money Stewart with my Christmas hat on. Saying goodbye, and y'all have a blessed, blessed Monday evening. Bye-bye.